on the field with Coach Adams after the NCAA tournament match. Coach Adams, your thoughts on tonight's game? Um, I thought it was an NCAA game. I mean, it went back and forth. I think both teams had brilliant moments, and um, at any time, I think either team could have won that game. Uh, you know, I am so proud of my Rice team. I thought the guts that they displayed tonight was incredible, uh, especially the second half. I thought. Uh, the instructions given to them at halftime were 100% executed in that second half and I saw nothing but intensity and heart just dripping all over the field when, when it ended. So as a coach, I couldn't ask for anything more um, for my 27 players. I thought they left it all out there. Um, you know, credit to Baylor. They're a tough team to play. They are physical. They are dominant in the air. And, you know, the first half I felt uh, we gave them way too much um, ability to do what they're good at. I mean, too many corner kicks, too many set pieces were given up. Um, and they had a bit of the momentum. But my team never stopped fighting back. And I'm, I'm just so proud of them. It's an unfortunate result, um, but it's something that this program can really learn from. I mean, the things we did this year uh, are, are just amazing. Top 25 uh, conference championship. We just uh, beat our all-time record for goals scored in a season. Uh, undefeated at home, and plus they're doing phenomenal in the classroom while doing all this on the field. So I'm a happy coach obviously obviously I'd love to win that game um, but you know when you when you leave everything out on the field there's nothing more than I can do than be just proud of them How about your senior class and then uh, particularly maybe Elisa getting rice on the board with uh, that goal in the first half yeah I thought uh, the senior class has been instrumental uh, for putting this program uh, on the map and each of them, I told them earlier, have left their legacy on this program and we can't thank them enough for everything they've done. Uh, you know that first goal was uh, from good play. We were able to switch the point of attack, get it in, and Aliza had a great finish uh, on that goal. And then, you know, in, on the second goal, Nia was able to get uh, wide, fantastic cross into Maskeska, who was so composed on the finish. So, uh, you know, the seniors had a hand in, in both goals. I think Nia had an opportunity to get us ahead with uh, uh, on an opportunity from McKeska in the box, but you know uh, she she had effort, and that's all we can ask for.